Amidst the sprawling fields and vast testing zones, the U.S. military was once at the forefront of experimenting with groundbreaking laser weapons. From the intimidating roar of the Navy advanced chemical laser to the prowess of the space-based laser, they were on the cusp of revolutionizing modern warfare. Their laser beams shimmered with potential, and some even achieved the incredible feat of destroying supersonic missiles. But like many tales of ambition, these lasers were shelved, their immense size and weight becoming their own adversaries. Half a world away, an announcement echoed from the heart of China, sending ripples through defense circles worldwide. The country's military declared a major breakthrough in energy weapon technology. A team of scientists from the National University of Defense Technology in Changsha revealed their latest invention to the world, a state-of-the-art cooling system for high-energy lasers. But why is this significant? Lasers, despite their futuristic appeal, come with a formidable adversary, heat. The buildup of excessive heat during operation has been a long-standing challenge often causing malfunctions or limiting the duration for which these weapons could be fired. But China's new cooling system promises to change this narrative. With their innovation, these lasers can now remain powered up indefinitely without succumbing to excessive heat. They can fire and maintain a laser beam for as long as required. In the world of military technology, this isn't just an advancement, it's a game changer. Published on August 4th in the Chinese journal Acta Optica Sinica, laser weapon scientist Yuan Shengfu couldn't contain his enthusiasm. He highlighted that their new development essentially wipes out the harmful heat that has long plagued high energy lasers. This is a breakthrough in improving the performance of high energy laser systems, he exclaimed. The stakes are high, and the world is watching. The U.S. had its brush with laser weapon systems, but the limitations of size, weight, and range meant they couldn't cross the finish line. Yet, Yuan's team not only promises a solution to the heating challenge, but also claims to have enhanced the destructive power of the laser beam. The implications of such advancements can't be understated. If China's claims hold water, they've managed to achieve something that the U.S., despite its vast resources, couldn't. Steve Weaver, a former British military official, mirrors the sentiment of many experts across the globe. If they have indeed conquered the heating and distortion challenges in a unit that's deployable, it's monumental. The U.S. had its challenges, and if China's leapfrogged those, it's indeed a breakthrough, he commented. But the possibilities don't stop there. Beyond their sheer power and improved operability, these new laser systems could be a more economical solution in the long run. Traditional missile systems come with a hefty price tag, with each missile being an expensive asset. In contrast, laser weapons, once developed, don't need expensive munitions. They can be quickly recharged and readied for action. There are even whispers that China might deploy these lasers against satellite systems, including SpaceX's Starlink. In the intricate dance of global military power, every move and counter move counts. While the U.S. once led the charge in the domain of laser weapons, China's recent announcement suggests a possible shift in the balance. As the world keeps a keen eye on these developments, one thing's for certain, the future of warfare might just be written with beams of light.